So today we're gonna to be making a beautiful, beautiful R&B beat. This one's gonna be for Kehlani, Lucky Day. So many ambient vibes. You guys are really gonna enjoy this one. I wanna take a quick pulse, man. Got a quick question for you. Where are y'all from? Let me know in the comments below. Go ahead and rep where you're from. It doesn't have to be super specific. I'm from California, Northern California to be exact. Shouts out to all of y'all that's been showing all the support. Let's get to work. Let's try something new today. Let's try jazz scale. Yeah, just a simple, simple, simple scale. Let's go ahead and drag the MIDI in. Let's go ahead and get this down to about 123 BPM, just to get us started. Turn on the metronome, and let's go ahead and figure out something we want to play. kind of fast. All right, so that's not a bad start. Let's go ahead and play with the octave a little bit. All right, let's go ahead and get some Omni and get some layering going. that let's go ahead and add a strum to this so we're gonna go alt s it's very subtle man I like that so let's go ahead and clone this again again just doing our layering here oh yeah Let's let these guys go a little bit longer since they're textures. So we'll go boom. And then same thing for this one, we'll go boom. For the Omni track here, we'll put it on the first mixer track and we'll go ahead and get the parametric EQ2. We'll go preset, so we'll go 40 hertz, 18. About 150 hertz, that's perfect. Now let's go ahead and get some reverb. So let's see, let's go ambiance, turn the size down. Oh yeah. Oh. We're gonna take our texture, we'll put it in the um, second mixer track, we'll go Parametric as well. We're going to cut out these lows. All right, and then we're going to add some dynamic to it as well. Um, we'll go ahead and add a pancake 
to that so we get some good panning in those ears. Just leave it on the default. So I think we need to layer out one more thing. So we're going to clone this Omni track. This is just coming out fan just fantastic, y'all. control up on it though take out these lows Ooh. all right let's go ahead and um move it off of the first mixer track oh my god Ooh. got some harsh highs in it so let's let's go ahead and put the parametric in there We'll go presets, 4018. Let's go ahead and uh, bring wider in there so we can get some nice panning in our ears. I think I'm gonna go ahead and begin with the percussion. And then from there, um, I'm probably gonna visit Arcade, but let's go ahead and start with the percussion. Let's take the headphones off for that. Oof. A good tip when you're working on your melodies, wear headphones. Like for some reason, you could just hear the frequencies better, I feel like, and like you could just get in the vibe. Um, it works out well for me. So we're gonna go ahead and hop into the percussion. All right, so let's go ahead and fill in each four steps. Let's go ahead and bring in Pancake on that as well. We'll leave it at the default. Beautiful, so we'll go ahead and clone that. And then I'm gonna go up into the unknown library. They have some crazy hi-hat midis that I'm just gonna just try it out and see how it works. So let's go ahead and add a little bit more, um, just a little bit more sauce to these hi-hats. Let's, let's go ahead and bring in Finisher. Phaser. wet snap and then we're gonna follow it up in those empty spots man we're, we're really really getting it on this one so it's gonna get some kicks going change the kick this kick is cool but it's just not what I'm looking for I think this is it we need arcade up in this thing man let's go and play it <laughs> wow that was just like okay okay that's what we gonna do then. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to find one more thing that's just gonna layer us up nicely. Maybe like a guitar riff or something. Um, 
and then we'll be good to go. That's gonna be the one for us. I really like this 808, but I'm thinking I'm gonna switch it up. It's not the right hit, it just needs to hit just right. So I'm gonna go ahead and go through. Perfection. So let's go ahead and arrange this thing. We're gonna go ahead and make sure everything is highlighted, everything is activated, and we're gonna go to patterns, split by channel, and that is gonna bring us up to our arrangement. So let's go ahead and highlight everything and we will a random color on it. And let's go ahead and start arranging it. So I think the first things first, um, I'm gonna go ahead and start off. I might make this a little different. Um, what if we start off with some percussion? And then we'll bring in another pad at the end. We'll go straight into a verse on this one. So let's go ahead and bring in pretty much everything and then we'll go sort it out um, as we're going. So first things first, let's take out this, uh, this kick here. We'll take out that, this, um, 808 and then we will take out a bunch of the atmosphere here oops we'll leave that there let's go ahead and listen to it real quick so we're going to take out the guitar we'll take out the 808 we're going to take out this lead um, arcade percussion and then we're going to bring that other hi-hat back in and then we're going to just start off uh, with a little bit of a buildup. We'll bring in that percussion loop from Arcade. And we'll just let it ride. And then we're going to go ahead and cut out the first part of the snaps here. And we'll let it come back in on the second half. And I want this just to be like hard right away. So let's go ahead and bring in that alternate, um, that alternate 808 from there. We'll just go ahead and let that keep riding out just as it was. This time we'll let the snaps come back in full force. And then we'll just continue with everything else. And then for the last half, we'll go ahead and take out this um, arcade loop. And then for the last half, we'll take out the kicks and we'll take out the 808 and we'll just let it ride out like that. Right before it drops, we'll take out the hi-hats. So, boom, boom. And we only did 12 bars on these, so. You can just make it however long you want, however short you want, there's no rules. Take our alternate kick and snare out here. And then we're gonna leave in our original kick and our original um, 808. And then we're gonna just let this ride out. And then we're also gonna duplicate that, but this time for the drop, we're gonna go ahead and let the 808 and kick just kind of stop for the first part, just so we can give it a little bit of vibes. All we're gonna do next is just copy all of this stuff. We're gonna copy, paste it in. So we have our first verse, first hook, second verse, second hook, and then we'll go ahead and copy the intro here. We're gonna use that for the outro and there's no rules you guys you can do it however you want but i kind of like to do it that way it's easy it's already built for us so yeah let's go ahead and listen to the beat mm -hmm. 